Madam Speaker, the Honourable Member from Jharkhand has raised a very important issue about the dispensation of justice in our country, which has been held up because of lack of computerization. In his detailed answer, the Honourable Minister has given some uh, statistics which uh, raise concern, Madam, because it seems only four high courts are using the e-filing system as of now, and that too, all of them are not doing it online. Some of them are doing it offline. This means that there is still scope for delays and manipulation, the same old problems that our legal system has been facing for all these decades. And the terminology used for the phase, uh, phase one of this implementation, such as LAN, local area network, is already outdated. Other ministries in this government are already using apps on smartphones. They are connecting through Wi-Fi. They are connecting through broadband connectivity. Would the Honorable Minister assure us that within a, a, a specific time frame, let us say a year or two, all high courts can be connected through broadband and an app and uh, have all online e-filing? Mr. Speaker, the Honorable Member, my good friend Mr. Panda is a very experienced Member of Parliament. He knows technology very well, I know that. But where he is confusing is, computerization of High Court is complete. E-filing depends upon the lawyers. And the lawyers must be trained. They must have the aptitude. And Honorable Madam, you are aware, many lawyers still enjoy filing in the proper written form. Therefore, it depends upon the attitude of lawyers as far as filing is concerned. But I take his point that we have to sensitize more that e-filing should start. Regarding the second part of all technology is concerned, we are updating it. I want to tell honorable member that today SMS, automatic SMS about filing date, case number, defect, next date are being conveyed through mobile phone. So we will apply more and more of technology as the time passes by.